I volunteer because I want to go in, into the medical field, hopefully, and this gives me an experience of what it would look like in the future. So. And I volunteer because I'm really interested in going into the medical field for my career, and I thought it'd be really interesting to work in a local hospital near me so I could get a feel for the environment. And we also get to help a lot of people. Yeah, it's really fun here. Yeah. Upon retirement, Grossmont Hospital had a course in clowning, how you clown, and I love the circus and clown, so I took that not realizing that part of the deal was that you clown at the hospital once a month for a year. Well, I came in here, I had been working in the radiology department, I was a radiologist, and I knew they would all say, we always knew he was a clown. So I came in terror until about four months, and then I said one day, you know, Bill, this is for the patients, it's not for you. And it's been wonderful, hasn't it? I help um, pretty much be a support system for mothers who are breastfeeding. Um, so when the mothers come in, I uh, weigh the babies to see how much they they weigh prior to getting fed. And um, once they get fed, fed uh, from their mother's breast, I can see how much they're transferring from their mother's um, breasts or whatever. And then I also um, help distribute beanies that we make in the volunteer center. Um, this is one of them. Um, and then also booties sometimes and jackets. It was a one time where we had jackets and blankets for the babies, um, just so that the babies can, you know, feel cozy when they're in coming in the women's center. The feeling I get is just a wonderful feeling. You're not having to pay me. I'm doing it because I want to. I want to feel that good feeling. And when people thank you and they say, do you get paid for this? I say, your thank you, your appreciation, that's how I get paid. So that's rewarding to me. I'm a newer volunteer at Sharp Grossmont. I uh, started about three months ago. And um, I have Ethel here by my side. Ethel is a terrier poodle. She's about five years old. She's been volunteering here at the hospital for a couple years now. And uh, I recently took over the volunteering uh, aspect for my mom, Claudia, who recently passed away. She had many years of and many hours of volunteering experience. And I saw the happiness it brought to her life and how she changed so many other people's lives by doing it. And so now I'm here to fill her shoes and take over her legacy. And as we go around the hospital, seeing patients, it's, a, it's really, really amazing to see the impact that a therapy dog will have on patients as they may be having uh, a procedure done, maybe going through chemotherapy, or you can see relatives and family and friends just sitting in the lobby in the waiting room. And it helps, just helps bring a smile to people's faces to make the day a little bit easier. And uh, I'm honored to be part of Grossmont. I'm honored to be here during volunteer month. And, uh, and it's, I can't, for anybody that's interested in going and getting out there and giving back to the community, I would truly recommend this as, an, as a great experience.